On this episode of Humanisters, we're going to examine what exactly makes us human. Is it our ability to read, to feel, to communicate? Is it our social patterns? Or perhaps a combination of all of these things? What exactly sets us apart from animals? Join us on our search for the truth. Our first comparative study will focus on our capacity to process literature. As you can see, the fish does not respond to the stimuli. With the fish, squirrel, ducks, and birds being unresponsive, we can assume only humans can comprehend and appreciate literature. In this next segment, we will assess human and animal participation in a cultural tradition that is unique to the Ohio State University. Despite their presence at Ohio State, the animals do not seem to be able to understand the Buckeye culture. Oh, but for humans, that's a different story. In this next study, we'll see if there's any difference between how humans and animals feel emotions. Here we see a dog and its owner expressing mutual excitement and happiness. Next, we will witness a common emotion among humans, jealousy. Man, where's my cookie at? In this next segment, we will be observing the ability of both an animal and a human to think abstractly. So Jake, how do you think the Buckeyes are going to do against Michigan? The dog is unable to comprehend human communication and is also unable to think of the future. So how do you think the Buckeyes are going to do against Michigan? I think they're going to whoop their butt. Biologically speaking, it's rather clear what differentiates us from animals. However, our studies lead us to believe that there is no clear answer, but rather a number of factors, such as culture, literature, emotion, and abstract thought, all contributing to that which makes us human. Thank you for joining us on this episode of Humanisters. I'm John Octavius. Cool beans. Next time on Humanisters. Who does give a damn for the whole state of Michigan? In this next segment, we will assess human and animal participation in a cultural tradition. As human and animal participation in a cultural tradition. I did it again. Participation in a cultural tradition. This is how you really say it. Cultural tradition. Yeah, just like. This next study will see if there's any difference between how humans and animals. Feel, feel, feel emotion. There it goes. Dude, look at it go, it's so fast. What do I do? Just throw the book? Just like throw the book. Throw, throw it.